big commerce dropshipping tutorial hi guys welcome back to another video and in this video we're going to be talking about how you can use big commas for dropshipping so having said that let's just jump into the video now first things first what you're going to do is you're going to come over here onto bigcommerce.com and you're going to sign up now the sign up process is very simple you just simply come over here you just simply click on the pricing plans right here click on the pricing and you are good to go here you can go ahead and view all plans right here and over here you can start your free trial before you can go ahead and purchase a plan so over here there are four plans there's the standard plan there's the plus plan the pro and the enterprise the enterprise is for as the name suggests for big corporations and with big money so you won't have to be picking that if you're just starting it out for you it would make more, more sense if you go with the standard or the plus plan so you can see all of their features and stuff like that so over here you can see you have product files storage and bandwidth is going to be unlimited staff account again unlimited you can open up to four online storefronts and price per additional storefront is going to be thirty dollars so so it's going to cost you thirty more dollars every time you open up a storefront and point of sale amazon ebay walmart facebook instagram google shopping you got tons of those feature wise you got all these cool stuffs available for you on all of these plans so you can go ahead and pause the screen right here read some of these or you can come over here and visit the website and read it for yourself but for now we're gonna go ahead and click on start your free trial and once we've done that over here we're gonna go ahead and fill out the form First name, last name, phone number, email address, password, store name, and what size is your online store. After that, we'll go ahead and click on create your store. And then your big commerce store is ready. Now all you have to do is you can add some of these information such as an existing website, what will you be selling, and what best describes your current, you know, product. So I don't have an existing website. What you will be selling, we'll, we'll be selling apparel and accessories and i sell mainly in person or in retail stores i'm not selling it i'll choose that you can choose whichever one you want it depends on you and then just simply click on finish and we are good to go now over here as you can see we have our dashboard and over here we have a bunch of stuff that we can do so this is a checklist right here these are the things that we need to do we need to add products uh, get to the shippings accept cash on delivery enable payments and set up tax rates right complete our storefront all of these things and once we're done we should be good to go and we have 15 days of trial so we can go ahead and play with it mess around with it see if it works or not on the left hand side you will have all of your main options such as your orders your products your customers uh, storefronts marketing analytics channel manager apps and all of that for the purpose of drop shipping what it does is you will take a product from one end and take it and sell it to the other right you aren't even doing it you're just saying that you have a customer over here he says i want this you tell it you want this and then you link the both becoming a middleman so for that purpose you'll have to go to apps and over here in the marketplace you're gonna have to search for some apps so let's go ahead and click on bigcommerce.com slash apps it's gonna take us to the app store and over here we have a bunch of different applications now let's go ahead and search for some drop shipping so we can even go into the categories i'm pretty sure we should have a category of drop shipping but if not we don't have to worry about it we'll just simply search for it we'll just simply search for drop and over here we have a bunch of different options so we have spocket drop shipping this is actually pretty cool uh there is a free trial for 30 days upfront free there is no upfront fee and recurring fee is going to be 29.99 it all depends on you and in my opinion, Spocket is an excellent application to use. It's one of the best ones out there. So you can go ahead and use it. So to install it, just simply click on Spocket. All right. And just simply click on get this application and you should be good to go. And we are good to go. There we go. We just simply click on install. Now it's going to go ahead and install it. And once it's installed, all you have to do is simply click on go to Spocket. And over here, this is how it will look like. You will have all these different products that you can go ahead and import onto your store. These are products from AliExpress, uh, Alibaba, basically other online stores, print on demand, stuff like that. You can go ahead and import them onto your store and you should be good to go. So over here on the left hand side, you have AliExpress, winning products, private labels, 
and all of that you can go ahead and add it and you should be good to go so this is a free extension called ali scraper what it does is whenever you go onto aliexpress you click on the spocket extension and it will instantly add that product that you're viewing into your store right here into the import list so let's go ahead and import some products so let's just say we are you know we want to sell this iphone case we'll just simply click on add to import list and you can even add it as well like manually so for that all you have to do is just simply click on add button right here and just simply fill out this form you add in the product name the sku the price the product type the brand weight description images all of these things you fill out this entire form as you can see there's a lot of you know information to fill out and once you filled out every single information you should be good to go and you should have something like this right so products like these as you can see right here these some of these are samples some i added so that you can see it and pretty simple and once you're done you can go ahead and start selling it onto your storefront so for that we click on view store on the left hand side it's going to open up another tab right here and over here is going to be your store so this is how it looks like over here is the product that i added right here as you can see uh if we go ahead and click on quick view we can see the price we don't have a review yet but we can add it later we have the description down here and we have the quantity and the price and all of that so pretty simple and these are like the demo products and this is a product that i added as well so as you can see very simple you can add different variants as well it depends on you when you're adding the product you can change some of the variants so pretty simple once you've added it you are good to go it'll already be on the store right you just got to make sure that it is actually on the store for that you just simply select the product choose an action you can bulk edit this or export these products or list these products on ebay as well it depends on you so you can even add some of the featured products are going to be over here you can add them right here free shipping last import out of stock not visible you're going to have a bunch of these different options indicating each uh, status of each product and as i said before finding products is not that hard all you got to do is just simply install the spocket uh you know application with it you can just simply click on add to import and it'll be imported over here in your import list and through here you can then convert these products to your shopify store and they'll be shown over here in the all product section and you can go ahead and edit it out change the name change the price change the some of the details a little bit and you are golden so pretty simple this is how you use big commas for drop shipping so hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did be sure to hit the like button subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications and also let me know in the comment section what you think about this video and also watch some of these videos as well that are on the screen it'll help you get started